how to use sprout social for beginners hi guys welcome back today i will show you how to use sprout social as a complete beginner for your social media management so let's get started sprout social is world's leading social media management platform that unlocks the full potential of social to transform your marketing strategy and help you get more productive with social sprout you will be getting all of the options such as engagement analytics and organizing your audience in order to manage your social media so if you are a marketing agent or maybe a social media influencer, then you can use Spell Social to manage your social media accounts and save your time. How to sign up for Sprout Social? Simply go to SproutSocial.com and you will land on this platform right here. You can simply go ahead and start your free trial for any of the plans available. Before we get into the different features and tools of Spout Social, let's go ahead and check out the pricing so you will have a better idea about the affordability of the platform. When we talk about the pricing plan, on Sprout Social, we get three pricing plans. We have a standard plan, which is going to be $89 per user per month built annually and $99 if built month to month. You can see right here with this plan, we will be getting five social profiles. We will be able to publish and schedule our posts. Then we get our own calendar, profile and keyword monitoring. Then we have a professional plan, which is going to be $149 per user per month if built annually and $169 if built monthly. And with this plan, we're getting 10 social profiles, scheduling and more. Then we have an advanced feature, which is going to be $249 per user per month and $279 if built monthly. And all of the features are listed below. You can select any of the plan and then you can click on start free trial to get a free trial and then simply buy this plan. So I'm going to go ahead and quickly sign up for Sprout Social. All you have to do is just enter your first name, last name, email address and password and click on create account. Once you sign up for Sprout Social, this is where you will get. This is my dashboard on Sprout Social. So let me show you around because we're getting a lot of different features and tools. So you will be able to find your company name right here. Then we have a dashboard. This is the basic dashboard where you will be able to find all of your latest activity, your published posts and more. Then we have a smart inbox, task, feeds, publishing, listening, reports, people and reviews. Then we have different options here such as notifications, team conversations, shared links, connect a profile, invite a team member, Twitter search, help center, keyboard shortcuts, and support resources. So on Sprout Social, the first thing that you need to do is simply connect a profile. To connect a social media, what you have to do is simply click on this option right here, which says connect a profile. Simply click right here. Now, we can go ahead and connect any social media to our Sprout Social, such as our Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, LinkedIn, YouTube, Pinterest, and more. Let's go ahead and connect a Facebook page. Simply click on Facebook. Then you have to select what you want to connect, your page, group, or ad manager. I'm going to connect a page. Now, simply go to Facebook, and then you will be able to connect your page. I have already connected my page, so that is why I'm not going to do that again. Now, if I go to Smart Inbox right here, this is actually our inbox that we get with Sprout Social. In this inbox, I will be able to access all of my messages. This is my Facebook page that I have connected to my Sprout Social. And you can see right here, I will be able to get all of my completed messages, saved messages, private, custom view and more. I can also go ahead and add filters i can actually go ahead and manage my comments message types i will actually get the list of all the pages or accounts that i have added right here we can also perform more actions such as you know complete thread 
export thread email message then we have the like option and a tag option as well we can actually go ahead and add different tags to our different pages and this will help us organize our pages we can set priorities and customer feedback similarly to create a new post or to create a task you can simply go to task option right here in task what i can do is i can create a team and then i can assign these different tasks to my different team members so this helps us organize our team as well if you have a small business then sprout social can really help you with your marketing to create a new post instantly you will find the option right here simply click on compose and in here you will be able to compose a post you simply select your social media i will be able to create a new post for my social media what i have to do is simply enter the details then we have the publish workflow if you want to add an approval from your team member you can simply go ahead and add it right here then you have your sprout tags you can simply go ahead and add different labels such as a video if it's an announcement or a blog so let's go with the video label then we have campaign if you want to track and report your social marketing campaigns then you can simply go ahead and create a new campaign as well creating a new campaign is really easy on sprout social you can simply click right here and then it will allow you to create a new campaign you give your campaign a name you add your date range then we have visibility campaign brief and more once you're done with all of the settings you click on save and a new campaign is created and then you can simply go ahead and add a campaign right here then you have schedule option where you can add a date and time to schedule your post and written what you want to write then you will simply click on schedule and a new post will be scheduled you will also be getting a preview right here that how your post looks for now i'm not gonna create a new post if i go to feeds right here then we get all of our feeds right here you can actually connect your feeds for example your instagram feed or twitter feed to your sprout social and don't need to open up your feed every time in feed option we can also create an rss feed then of course we have a publishing option then again takes you to compose a new post that i just show you then we have our people option that allows us to manage our followers and our different subscribers these are the different options that you get to invite a team member you can simply click right here enter their first name last name and email address click on add an invitation will be sent to your team member and this way we can simply go ahead and organize our team then we have our team conversation option and shared links in shared links you will be able to find my links and all links that you have actually connected you will be getting all of your notifications right here you can also manage your hashtags with your sprout social Another important feature is the report option. In reports, I will be able to get my strategy and insights. I will be able to get my all stat analytics for all of my social media, such as my YouTube and Pinterest, Facebook, LinkedIn, and others. So this is how you simply use Sprout Social for your social media. It's an amazing professional tool to help you build your social media accounts and run a successful business. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the YouTube channel.